So for anybody who wants to make a lot of business, um, make a lot of money in a business, I suggest starting your own fad diet. Um, it's not complicated. Um, what you need is, is a dieting deity, uh, somebody like uh, the Reverend Atkins who is going to tell you he's got this magical formula which is going to make calories uh, banish. Then you need products to sell and then you have to have this magical diet, this combination of foods that somehow obviates all the, all the rules of thermodynamics and causes food to just combust in midair, right? You can eat whatever you want. Um, here's the basic problem with the fad diets. I, I've been trying to help patients lose weight for the past 15 years, and, and the most effective models I've ever found are these. This is a replica of a pound of fat, and this is a replica of a pound of muscle. And if you notice, uh, this is a little more dense than this, and uh, that's why people say generically that, that, that fat weighs less than muscle. What they mean is this takes up more space. The problem with this fat is there are 3,500 calories in every pound of this. 3,500 calories. Now the average person walking on a treadmill might burn 300 calories an hour. Think about how much time you have to spend on that treadmill just to burn one pound of fat. It's a huge amount of work. So the key is not to accumulate too much of this in the first place. But the, the great lie in fad diets is that when people lose eight pounds in their first week, they get all excited. They didn't lose eight pounds of fat. They lost eight pounds of water. Congratulations, you're dehydrated. But it's not going to help you get rid of the enemy. So. The bottom line is people have to understand the arithmetic in fat loss and they have to understand that if they're going to lose weight, they're going to be hungry. They're going to be hungry and it's not going to feel very comfortable and they're going to have to exercise and it's no fun. Um, anybody who tells you you can eat what you want and lose weight is lying to you.